This is a plain table top. This is like a, a drying mold which is made up of seasoned wood, 30 cm by 40 cm in size. We mount plain uh, sheet, drawing sheet on it firmly and we prepare the map. We draw the objects on that one. So our first objective is that we have to keep the plain table top level. This is LED. In the LED, there is a bubble tube. So you can see this bubble tube. If, if this bubble tube is in the center, that means your plane table is level. If it is not, then using these three legs, you can give movement to these three legs and change the level of the plane table top. So once the plane table top is level, you don't have to apply too much of pressure on it. If you apply too much of pressure, the leveling will be disturbed. So after leveling, the second step is the orientation. We have to orient this plane table top with respect to north direction. So there is a, a magnetic needle here. So if I release this magnetic needle, so the needle here is indicating the north direction. Can you see this needle? Yes. Yeah. So this is indicating now the north direction. So that means now this direction is north. So I have to orient my plane table either with respect to north or with respect to the plotted points. So this is the second step. The third step is bisecting and taking the measurements. So when we are doing bisecting and taking the measurements, we take help of this LED. So this LED has two veins. These veins are perpendicular to this base plate and one side you can see very fine holes. So through these fine holes, we can bisect the object from this side. And the other side, which has a very fine thread in the middle. Mm. So this fine thread has to be towards the object. So this fine hole is towards the eye. Fine, this thread is towards the object. I will bisect the object from a known station and draw the ray take the measurements on the ground and cut down that measurement. So what we do is we fix up a sheet, a drawing sheet, firmly to this plane table. So when we fix up this plane table uh, sheet, then what we do is we, all along the four edges, we fix it with a shallow tape so that there are no wrinkles. And we plot our points on this sheet. So let us say, there is a point A here whose coordinates are known to me. So from this point A, I will draw a ray to unknown point. Now to that unknown point could be a tree, could be corner of the building. So I will bisect say for example a tree like this from a point A. And I will measure from here plane table to that tree positions the distance A, either using tachymetry or with a tape. If I give you a tape, you measure the distance. So suppose this distance is 20 meter. You convert that distance on the plotting scale and there is a scale here also on this side. This is known as the fiducial edge of the LJ. So you cut down that distance in the same direction and mark the position of the tree. So this is the way plane table is carried out and what we do at the same time we find out the elevation of A also. So we carry level on a star with us while doing plane table. So that we know the elevation of those points. We note down the elevations and write the elevation value. And these elevation values later on we'll use for computing the, or drawing the contours to know the slope, to know the topography. So planimetry we are drawing with the help of the alidate and levels we are using a leveling staff and a leveling instrument to note down the elevations of the various points. So this is the way the plane table is prepared. There are now four methods and the most popular method and simple method is the radiation method when we have to cover a small area. If we have to cover a larger area then there is another method which is intersection method. So intersection method is faster but may not be as accurate as radiation method. In radiation method we are taking observations of most of the points, surrounding points with the help of a tape or with the help of the tachymetric observation and cut down at the plotting scale and draw the features.
by intersection method from two known stations we are drawing a ray from one known station we are drawing a ray from another known station and intersection of that ray will be us so that's a graphical method so here because we are doing plane table in a small area we will mostly use radiation